And we're back now with more from uh, Senator Schumer and former Vermont Governor Howard Dean. Uh, Governor Dean, let me just uh, quote to you something that Peggy Noonan, she's going to be on our roundtable in just a minute, but she wrote in the Wall Street Journal, and I'm quoting now, and she's talking about the president. She says, this is the problem of the world now. Big Mike, no message. If you have nothing to say, does it matter that you have endless venues in which to say it? Uh, she said that the president uh, has not only has nothing to say, he's actually become boring. How, as a Democrat, would you respond to that? I think, I think that's just silly. Um, the fact of the matter is the United States is in much better position in terms of our foreign security than we have been in a long time. Some of bin Laden is dead. Uh, we have our troops out of Iraq. Our troops are coming out of Afghanistan. This is, these are things that are important to the United States. Secondly, there's been four million new jobs added since Barack Obama took over the presidency. Now, there's been some loss. Uh, there's been some loss in the public sector. So the Tea Party people ought to be happy. In fact, government is shrinking. Um, I think we've made some real progress. We have two thoughtful, sensible justices on the Supreme Court. No more right-wing extreme people. Uh, we have. Uh, a medical system, while it's more complex than I think it would have been uh, desirable, uh, every tw person under 26 whose parents have health insurance now have health insurance. Uh, and in two years' time, assuming this, the court doesn't change this around, uh, people are not going to be excluded from having insurance because they're sick. Real progress has been made both in terms of American security, in terms of bringing our troops home, in terms of making people more secure at home because of their health care. I think that's a pretty good record for President Obama to run on. Let me ask you, Senator Schumer, just a straight political question. Uh, the backbone of the president's support, of course, the, the last time was African Americans. Uh, he still has a majority of African Americans now, uh, overwhelmingly, according to most polls. But I noticed that the number of Afri African American registered voters has dropped to about uh, dropped about seven percent now, uh, about five percent drop in Hispanic Americans registering to vote, and it's even uh, larger drops in some of the key states uh, like uh, New Mexico, for example. Is the president in danger of losing uh, some of his uh, bedrock support, the core of his support? How does he get those people back? No, I don't believe so. I you think don't. you'll see as large an African-American turnout, if not larger, uh, than uh, previously in the last election. The Hispanic uh, turnout will be large and the vote will be a greater margin for the president. It's now something like three to one. And frankly, I don't see how Mitt Romney can win if it stays that way. He cannot win the states of Colorado and Nevada and New Mexico and probably not Florida, which makes his electoral math impossible. So I think you're going to see the minority vote going strong. And then there's the woman's vote, which you talked about before. Yeah. And I'd like to mention um, the Republican Party doesn't seem to care about women, not just yeah. on the issues like contraception, but on economic issues as well. Uh, okay. We're going to bring to the, can I? Oh, let, me tell you, let me interrupt you because we're getting yeah. close to being out of time here. And I do want to ask you about gay marriage. Uh, to both of you, uh, what do you think? Should the president just go ahead and say that uh, he's for it and, and uh, get it over with because uh, Vice President Biden uh, said today he's comfortable with it? Uh, could I get a, just a yes or no from you, Senator? Well, I think the bottom line is everyone knows that the president is much strongly, more strongly for LGBT rights than in the Republicans. And okay. I think that it's not going to be even a contest okay. in that community. 